Our top story tonight, the car of a woman missing since July found in Heard County tonight, along with a body inside. The GBI tells us the car belongs to Natalie Jones, but the GBI has not confirmed if the body inside is hers. Joe Henke has been talking with her family and is live outside the GBI tonight with the very latest Joe. Well, Aisha, the GBI tells me an autopsy will be needed to positively identify that body that was found inside the car of Natalie Jones. Meanwhile, I've been talking with Natalie Jones' sister. She tells me law enforcement in Heard County has told Natalie Jones' family that the body found is, in fact, Natalie Jones. Three months ago, Natalie Jones, a mother of two children, disappeared. We talked with Jessica Bishop, Jones' sister, shortly after Jones was reported missing. We had no idea. It, it's literally like she was just picked up out of nowhere and vanished. Bishop said all activity stopped on her sister's social media and bank accounts. The Heard County Sheriff's Office in July confirmed Jones was considered a missing person. With investigators telling 11 Alive she was last seen in Jackson's Gap, Alabama, just before 1 p.m. on July 5th, along with her hot pink 2002 Chevrolet Cavalier. Late last month, a petition started online, asked a grand jury to investigate Jones's ex-boyfriend, who is in the Troop County Jail on an unrelated charge. The family says they did not start the petition, but do support investigating anyone possibly connected to Jones and her disappearance. Jones's sister talked with us again last week. Somebody has to know something out there. She didn't just disappear on her own by herself just out of nowhere. So, Joe, this is a new layer today with those findings, but what do we actually know about the investigation into Jones's actual disappearance? Well, so far, not a lot of details about that. We are told the Heard County Sheriff's Office is leading the investigation. They're being assisted by the GBI. The GBI tonight only confirming that the body found was inside Natalie Jones's car, but so far law enforcement to us not confirming that ID. But as we mentioned there, Jessica Bishop, her sister, is confirming to us that law enforcement is talking with the family and saying that that body is Natalie Jones's. We'll send it back to you. All right, thank you, Joe. Thinking of that family tonight.